What's going on, YouTube? It's Pete Ellis. And today, I'm going to do something. Uh, I'm going to go through the sounds on the Roland FA-61. Now, um, the sounds that I'm going to be playing with are from the Jupiter 8, the JP-8000, the SH-101, the JD-800. Um, there's a whole lot of sounds. So basically what you can do with this board is you can go to the Roland website and you can add other sounds on this board uh, from vintage synthesizers, the ones I just named, uh, including the D50 as well. So I'm gonna go through some of the sounds. I mean, these sounds are phenomenal. I mean, just check this. Uh, this is uh, this is from the Jupiter. Uh, this is from the Jupiter Eight, and it's the OB strings. <laughs> This one is from, ooh, I believe this one is from the JP-8000 as well. Here is called Trans Line, and this is also from the uh, JP8000. <laughs> trying to get everything together to do some um, real good tutorials. So uh, this one right here is called the Square Lee. Pretty good sound. This one right here comes from the Jupiter 8 as well. And uh, this one right here is like a polysynth. It's called Residue. This comes from the uh, JP8000 as well. remember this patch this this comes from the um, I believe the Jupiter 6 I believe uh, it's called stack heaven <laughs> It's called the drawing pad. Love the sound. Love the sound. We got the Juno pluck from the uh, JP eight thousand. <laughs> Nice, nice sounds on here. This one right here. 
is called the Shamu. <laughs> from the Jupiter 8 as well. It's called the Thick Pad. Some real nice stuff on here. This one right here is from the uh, JP8000 as well. mistaken this is from the SH01 JD 800 is called the D50 Velo Brass. Beautiful. This one right here is from the JD 800 as well. Uh, this is called the Pro F Brass. So uh, check it out. JD 800 if a lot of you uh, synth heads if you fooled around with the JD 800 back in the day you know that there was other sounds you could put in that keyboard besides the uh, 72 uh, stock sounds that it had inside the board but uh <laughs> I'm trying to play chords with it. This is uh, from the Jupiter 6, I believe. It's the uh, SH2 and 5 squared. <laughs> patch from the uh, SH-101. Beautiful. Spit brass. <laughs> Mono lead from the uh, 
Jupiter 8. Beautiful sounds. to some of the let's get out the leads because I have to play that one that one's called Sami and I love that one right there but let's go to uh, let's go to that was called Solina, Solina from the Jupiter 8, but there are some real serious sounds on here. sound right here is called PG Phasers from the Jupiter 8 as well. Love these patches, man. That's called the JP Square Pad from the Jupiter 8. And... I mean, it's just so many, just so many different sounds. Here goes the, uh, this is a, uh, this is the acoustic piano from the JD eight hundred. <laughs> Pretty soon, here goes uh, the JD800. Uh, this is probably one of the best electric pianos that Roland made, in my opinion. This patch is called the Crystal EP. <laughs> They have, uh, like I said, more JP 8000 uh, 8, sounds. <laughs> JP 8000 as well. So just to let everybody know, okay, so on this keyboard, Damn, play. 
play riffs. I love this board. This right here is from, I don't really, I'm not familiar with this keyboard, but it's a vintage keyboard. It'll tell you right here, uh, it'll show the picture of the keyboard. It's a vintage keyboard. It's, I don't know what this could be from, but it's called Pip Square. Now, just to let everybody know, let me just do a recap on something right here. This is just one sound bank, okay? There are probably over 15 that you can put in here. You only have two at a time. You put them in here via, via a USB stick off the rolling website. But check this out right here. This is where things get a little interesting. And like I said, I'm trying to get my equipment up to par and everything. So y'all bear with me, man, as far as my recording stuff. You know what I mean? Um, you also can load sounds from a different section on the website via the SD card. Now with this right here, I probably got like five different sound banks on here. And a lot of them come from the Integra 7 uh, sound module, but there are more from vintage keyboards on here as well. Like I said, I named all the vintage keyboards, you know what I mean? So sounds because I'll be here all day long but this is just uh, I'm in the section right now that'll take you to all the sounds that you put in uh, via the SD card and there's a lot of D50 you see how warm that is there's a lot of D50 sounds on here as well man That's one of the bell pads, you know, that the D50 had. And, uh... So many sounds, man. This is, you know, and I'll do a video later going through, um... Going through all these, uh... Sounds, you know, on the Integra. Because a lot of people... A lot of people tend to neglect the possibilities that you can do with these keyboards. You just don't have to use the sounds that come with the board. Man, Roland offers, I mean, they offer so many different sounds on here. You know, it's almost as if, like, they made a mistake. You know what I mean? Because once somebody figures out this board, there's no need for you. Let me just say something real quick. Let me play something real quick. Check this out. I just played for you I made these sounds on this keyboard it's so easy and I had the system eight okay but when I wanted to when I wanted to do sound design it's like with the system eight I couldn't like the effects are good but I want to be able to have a slow release on one oscillator and then have a quick release on the next one, I want to. You couldn't do that with the system, eight, but with the Roland FA, you can do that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I made these sounds I'm playing for you right now. I made these sounds with this board from scratch, from a simple wave. And the effects on this board, the effects that you can put on your oscillators, out of this world. I promise. I'm going to try to do a video tomorrow on that. Like I said, I'm trying to get my software together uh, so I can record these videos and show y'all the screen and make it good quality. But until tomorrow, it's your boy P. Ellis. I'm signing off. Peace out.